Hello everybody, uh, I am going to get, show you guys the Hammer and Anvil MLK SLR 100 microphone. I grabbed it at a pretty good discount of 20 bucks. I believe regular price is 40. Um, I've spent a little bit of time with it, but not a whole lot of time actually using it. Uh, so I am hoping this video kind of opens my eyes a little bit more. Um, I've already opened it, so this will not be an unboxing, but I do have everything right here with me. I'm recording right now with a Canon 70 Mark II with a Sigma 17 to 50 f 2.8 um, HSM lens. Uh, so you will hear the autofocus clicking. Uh, right now it's recording with the onboard microphone, and I'll switch to the hammer and anvil so you can hear the difference. So right now we have our box. Um, it's a pretty nice packaging, nothing too fancy. And here are the specs, if you can see that without the glare, I'm trying. Alright, in the box we have a carrying pouch, the dead cat, and the microphone itself. The pop filter does come off. kind of hard to do one-handed sorry guys so there's the microphone uh, the only con control you have on here is your on off switch right here by my thumb and on top here is your uh, AAA battery compartment it does require a battery uh, and it connects to a three and a half millimeter jack now if you give me just a moment I'm gonna plug the camera in uh, so you guys can hear the difference. All right, I've got the microphone attached on top. Um, I did not point out earlier, but that on that is a shock mount between the hot shoe mount and the microphone itself. So I am handheld, and that's on purpose to see how well this shock mount works. Um, I did see an early video where the person was claiming that the shock mount didn't do anything, uh, so I'm a little bit curious to see how well it works for me. Um, I, in a trial I did earlier, I thought it, it worked pretty well, so hopefully uh, the same results with this video here. Um, so I'm recording with the hot shoe, uh, I'm sorry, the hammer and anvil microphone currently, not the onboard microphone. Earlier was the onboard microphone of the camera. So hopefully you hear a difference. Um, I'm going to pan around a little bit so you can see how well the microphone picks up from behind. Um, it's a directional microphone, so it won't completely eliminate all sounds, but it should minimize sounds from behind. And hopefully that's reflected. Um, let me know what you guys think if uh, you want me to try something else. I don't usually do these kinds of videos, but hey, I got it for cheap. I figured why not? And uh, let me know if you guys are, you know, pick one up and what you guys think of it. Thanks.